everybody here has fled something pretty horrific. Um, they don't necessarily talk about that with one another, but they all know that that's the kind of that's the kind of the background for everybody. Uh, I had problems with Ethiopian government. They took me to prison. They hurt me. I've been tortured for six months. They face often years of fighting through the asylum system. Um, the members describe this as a second torture. The asylum process is something really, really difficult, especially when you have to wait for so long. Room to Heal is a grassroots charity. We support people who've survived torture and other human rights abuses. We have two main teams, a therapy and casework team, and they work hand in hand really to support people through all the practical problems they're facing, like getting a lawyer, um, if they're homeless, helping them find housing and so on. And then the therapeutic team, helping them to rebuild trust. And then on a Friday, we gather in a beautiful garden, Culpeper. There is a place where when you enter there, you feel loved, you feel safe. There's a group of everybody who is going through many, many challenges and in different ways. It gives me a family. It provides a kind of place away from the kind of noise and conflict of life. We relate, we hug, we eat, play music, tell our stories. We don't want to do our work kind of isolated from the wider community. They come, you know, they join us around the fire, they sit down with us for food, they're interested in what's going on, and slowly, slowly, on both sides, people get to actually kind of um, talk to one another. Personally, Mark has turned my life around. I see Mark more or less like my elder brother or my bigger brother, if I can put it lightly, because he got me from my lowest ebb. Room to Heal is this, functions almost as an alternative kind of family, right, for, uh, and for people that have actually lost their family and lost their community and all the rest of it. Um, and that at the heart of that, there's just something very loving, you know, um, and, that's, and that's what people kind of need and want. I wish Room to Heal could grow and grow into a bigger thing. And I wish I could give back something.